Hey guys, it's Renee. So today I'm in a bit of a different spot for the intro because I'm going to be showing you guys a tuna and cheese roll tutorial like me making it. In my last video I mentioned that a tuna and cheese sandwich was literally the best thing ever so decided to do the same thing as a tuna and cheese sandwich but instead of using normal bread I'm going to use a roll. So let's just get started. Okay, so now I'm a bit lower so you can see like the table and my head. First, you're gonna to wanna to take a roll. So let's just take it out of the bag. So now we have the roll. I'm just gonna get a knife. We have our knife here. So I'm just gonna cut this up. You just cut it up like that. Now I'm going to get a can of tuna. Okay, so I've got my can of tuna here. It's the Mexican style tuna. This one's from Woolworths. I also use a sweet chili one. That's also really good. But you can use like any tuna, but like those two are just like the best in my opinion. With that teaspoon, I'm going to scoop out the tuna. and just put it on the thing um, as much as you want. Also, I'll have the tuna challenge in the eye there. I'll have the tuna challenge because I'm such a good YouTuber. Now I'm gonna get some cheese. So I have a block of cheese and grater. I'm not gonna grate the cheese, I'm gonna use this to cut the cheese you can use a knife if you want but i'm so bad at cutting cheese with a knife so i'm just going to do this and then it just cuts it like that and i'm going to do it once more now that i've got two slices of cheese i'm going to like size it so it fits perfectly in the roll and I've got two leftover cheese bits here, so I'm going to use the leftover tuna and just eat it. Now I'm going to close this here and then I'll meet you at the grill. Okay, so the grill is right here and I'm going to turn it on. And then wait for this light here to switch to green and then I can put it in. Make sure I put this sandwich press. And then I'm going to wait till that turns green and then I'm going to put my roll in. So as I wait for that to heat up, I'm going to just eat the rest of my tuna because there's a fair bit left. Okay, so you can hear it's ready now and it's gone green. I've got my roll here. Let's open this and then put it in. And then we, you put it more far back so then it like covers the whole thing. So yeah. Also, while we wait, just need to show off my Keys to Paris hoodie. You can buy it now. I don't know if they're all sold out or not, but on Instagram it's at Keys to Paris. Shout out to my brother. It's so comfy. 10 out of 10 would recommend. But yeah. Okay, now that we've taken it out, it's on a plate, I'm gonna cut it in half. Oops. Okay, it's cut up. Now, let's do a taste test. 
it's gonna be so hot so I know this is gonna taste good but that is so good I would highly recommend making this whether it's with normal bread like this or with some rolls I would recommend making it okay so I hope you like my video this week it was a bit of a different video I don't usually do this sort of video but I thought I would do it anyways make sure to like subscribe and turn on those post notifications so you never miss a video also I might be uploading bonus videos and they'll be uploaded on Friday and I don't know if I will upload it so make sure to turn on your post notifications for that I'll also have all of my social media that I have in the description box below and yeah toodles <laughs>